Oh, it is not a small something. No. As wise one, don't give her woto woto back to Mary. Hey, hey. He don't give her back woto woto. Oh, now remember the video where we say Mary talk say after he don't deal with lemon finish. Say now wise one go be the next person where we say go deal with for putting mat for a marriage matter. <laughs> My people. Wise one, don't come out now. He don't, he don't analyze and give Mary. He don't tell Mary. I'm Mary. They use the hand. They scatter in marriage. I'm Mary with the family. They scatter the marriage because Mary no one marry again. If Mary won't marry, Mary no go use the hand. They scatter in marriage. My people, he don't analyze and give and give and what to what to front and back. My, I not just want to talk too much. Make now listen to what wise one talk. If you hear this vid video finish, do not forget to share. Drop your comments on the comment section and follow me on my page, Linda G's TV. Guys, share this video. Share our woto woto. Comment on the comment section and do not forget to put the like button. See you, my people, for me to you now. Bye bye. Mary says she wants to arrest me. Mary Rahim opened her mouth and said she wants to arrest me. Wisdom Wabu is the wise one. No problem, it's very fine. Yeah. Thanks to God Almighty, you have my address. You know where I stay? If you don't have police around you, there are policemen. There's a police station not too far from me. So when you come, you can branch there and pack a lot of policemen as you want to. They can even come with helix or even a more tank. Yeah, so they can pick me very fast and arrest me. As a common criminal, as a thief, yeah. Arrest me and put me in jail if possible. Yeah, now, Retigam Nangana. Etiam Nanga. No one has said 25 years imprisonment. As I was into a fraudulent act now. I committed a very big crime. Now, I saw the video you did some days ago. Just like you said, this message is for wise one. This message, too, is for you, Mary Rahim. I watched the video you did about me to days ago so i watched everything i decided to keep quiet i'm not going to say anything if i wanted to reply you know me that very day sap i go and say you too much the next day i decided to keep quiet and not say anything but the kind of calls i've been receiving and text messages and the rest of them chats i just couldn't hold it i go you don't talk your own i go talk out now let's start from the onset of everything how everything Began. Let's have a recap. You said it with your mouth openly. That's very nice. I've never said something like that, but you said it. That the family, you made a mistake of marrying to a family that did not accept you. That was your first wrong. Marrying to a man that the family does not accept you. In marriage, you have to get married to the family first. The mom, the dad, the brothers, the siblings, everybody, even the friends. Those guys, free, see friends. Those people are the board of directors. Don't get me wrong. Only those who understand what I mean would understand where I'm going to. Ehadikilo is like a proverb. You have to win the heart of almost everybody. I know you can't make everybody your friend. You can't be a blessing to everybody. You can't. They get some people where this terrible regime. I don't favor. Just three or four months on seats. They don't. They happy. They know what making come out. Yeah, that's the pure fact. You can't please everybody. But at the long run in marriage, to an extent, you need to win the heart of 90% of the family and friends before coming in but what did you do no you didn't bother thank god he said he made a mistake of getting married of accepting a ring of a man that the family does not shows interest that they don't want you that means it's not going to last it's literally not your fault it is bound to be because the bible says honor your father and your mother so that your days will be long because they are like your mini god g with small letter g o d on earth Whereby you make their son go against the rule, their rules, their opinion, and getting married to you, you're fully aware. Of course, you'll be aware that it's not going to last, even if anybody did not even interfere. It is not going to last because it is there, there is no parental blessing from your husband's side. You've not you've never seen them visited you. Eat your food. You know, identify with you as their daughter-in-law. And you went ahead to stay there and you're expecting it to last. Not that I'm happy that it's breaking, no. I just want to analyze everything you said one after the other. Now, you said I have no right to interfere in your marital issues. 100%, you're right. I have no right. 
to interfere your marital issues. But David, like you said, is my friend. He's not even my friend, no. One name Moke is my blood. He's a brother. Now, we are more like even brothers. If there's another word for brother, that's what you can use to identify the both of us. So I can't sit down and watch him drown in the name of I don't want to come inside your marital issues. No. If he should come out, why they get caught, George could talk. Mm, problem the person deal with the sort of out. You call me a two faced person. Two faced. Because I was simply on your side before. When they were throwing your bags out, I was bringing them back. When you were having issues, I was mainly on your side, you know, trying to make sure these things work out. Even when you came back recently, you were sleeping on the couch. Now, I still come talk to her, make you allow you at least enter guest room. Now, because you are not changing, there is no atom of changing you. You're like a chameleon. You adapt to every color that you find yourself in. Today you are black, tomorrow you are blue. Today you are smiling, tomorrow you are nagging. And I decide to stand on the side of my friend. Make that guy no get hypertension. Pass out. I'm now a two-faced person. I'll take that as a compliment. Thank you very much. When you got married to this young man, all of us follow go. Yeah. I lie down for granted. I stain my white. If I don't like you and our friends, they sit down and talk. Our wife, our wife, if they're there two, three gather, they know who the real wife be. Don't be deceived when four guys they shout our wife. In fact, now you will not be the wife, then they call our wife. The main wife, then they call our wife. I went there, everything, everything started. The pranking and the rest of them, we pranked you. It was the same Facebook fans that asked Lemon to prank. We brought the idea of the prank, we did it, and you went to see your ex. Now let's talk about that, your ex. He said you owe nobody any explanation. You've not even given a concrete explanation what you went there to do. You said it's, you guys went for a business talk. Business, no getting Is it buying and selling? Is it pure water? Is it electronics? Is it accessories? Is it building material? What exactly is this business that you want to go and do with your ex that you know fully well that your husband, which happened to be your mini god, G-O-D, small letter, on earth, yeah, is not in support of it would not take it bible say man love your wife which i don't which when you both were very much together if you can tell yourself the truth david lemon showed you 100 percent love <clears throat> let's face facts he's stubborn he's rude he has his own fault in fact both of you are very much at fault Bringing out your family name online, saying all the things he has done for your family, shouting and rest of them, that's a total no for me. It's zero. I'll say it here without hiding mouth, without looking at anybody's face. That's a very big force from his own side. Now, the Bible says, honor your husband. Woman, man, love your wife. Woman, be submissive. What is the Bible talking about when you have been submissive? It's all respect, honor, obedience. They say sit down, sit down. They say stand, stand. They say go. Good, they say, come, come. They say, cook, you cook. Everything your husband wants, you should do. Because you left your parents, he left his own to stick, you guys stick together to become one body, flesh, soul, and spirit. Your husband does not want to see you with the ex. You are where? You went there with your nose marks on, your big mommy, you connived with her. She was, he called her and she said, that you are in the house. Pass the phone to you. You're in the kitchen. When you're done, you're going to have the phone and talk to him. And he can boldly see you in the atrium with your ex. And he want that man not to rave mad. And you came back home that night very, very late. When I mean late, I mean an ungodly hour. A married woman should not, even girlfriend and boyfriend, babe, not supposed to come back home by that time. Talk more of a married woman. And you said for a business discussion. What is this business discussion? Are they talking about, is it contraband goods? Is it something that you are hiding? If it's a normal, legit business, why don't you say it out? Clear the whole world. Let everybody hear the kind of business you're discussing with your ex. Fine, you guys were in an open place, an eatery. But after then, he was very much aware when you guys drove out. What happened all that time? He said he went back to your big mommy's place and you came back late at night. 
And your big mom, okay, fine. The guy is now aware of what you did. What did your big mommy do? Did she ever? An elderly woman with gray hair. I thought gray hair represents wisdom. Did she ever call back and say, My son, no, no verse for me. Is that I like that deal? See, see, see. Now, ex, you go see, but see what happens. See what No. It's that she stood in your favor, supporting you. Truly, truly, you apologized. I can vividly remember. You said you were sorry. Now, the question is, what exactly was the discussion between you and this ex? Like I said in my previous video, man, men, we men, our head is very fragile. A woman can see his hus he can see her husband with another woman and just one, two, three apology. The woman is okay. Some not even three. But a man, once you see that crack in brain, don't scatter. It takes time to amend. Our emotional strength is not the same as your gender. At all, it's not the same. You apologize to him so very much. Fine, you did. You apologize to him. Did you try to convince him that yes, nothing happened? I don't know if there any if anybody is understanding me. Like, you know, from there to where I don't know till your big moment is back home late in the night and you expect the man not to think otherwise. If to sit down there be like me, God do I say yes, once person enter, if you look I'm no who enter, I will not enter. It would have been a very, very simple and easy case. Instead, no. It's bringing bass, you're bringing bows. You know what silence has done in a very long while? Your husband is talking, you're not talking, you just go, why? He said, no, I used to destroy almost all the properties in his house. They scatter them up and down. Toys, passport, do so many things. We do. Okay, you guys are still having issues. You withdraw money. Now, me advice her. Even when you people are still having issues, and are still day on ground, they fight. Now, me still call and say, young man, see, allow this girl be. I was still on your side. Can she have access to her card so at least you can be having one or two phones you know she was, since you're not giving her allowance at least maybe she did take from there they take the world at least maybe she stop jumping bike and kick the drive till today david is still blaming me for that thing i did for that decision i made him take they had the decision he hear me say okay they did they release the card to you on freeze your account you withdrew 3.7 million to do it eh? what did you do with the money you sold the car that means you had plans of living. You won't go. If you're not living, why are you selling your husband's car for crying out loud? Why are you destroying properties that you call? It is your home, your marital home. Why are you breaking the TV? Why are you spoiling things when you know you want to stay? You had intentions of living. You won't go. If you, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. In Hakata Kwan Neko, nobody will get intention of begin to spoil what he be in. Oh, no. What kind of anger issues is that? You got intention you want to leave now, thirdly, or whatever. I don't know, number why they you're building two houses in your village. Your husband is not aware. Do you know? Do you know? Mba, let them understand what I'm saying. Do you know that if it's not for this issue, probably you would have been in the fourth of his house. It's giving you a very huge allowance. You have access to his account, you take as you like. You could only the third house or fourth house in no go still no. When you were caught, say you were trying to surprise him. <laughs> Tell another person, you're not talking to four, four-year-old boys. Say it to somebody else. Like I said I was, in the beginning, I was just saying, I'm still waiting for you to bring the police for them to come and arrest me. Wisdom, what was the wise one? They come and pick me up. Of course, you know where I stay. Yeah, that's a very good. I don't need to give you the address. But if you don't have it, I can still retext it to you. I can't wait to be handcuffed and, you know, pushed into the hillocks, you know, as a common criminal. Move, move, move. Yeah, I can't wait. Come pick me up. Please do. And for your information, huh? Huh? I would, I would not stop talking about it. I don't care what anybody wants to comment. I'm freaking... Do you know what I'm... It's like I'm used to... I don't know. This comedy people are even bringing up of, uh, go and get married. This one is spoil your marriage. I'm like, it's not getting to me anymore. Look for something very, very, you know, we go really touch me because I'm used to the old, old comments. As far as David Lemon is concerned, I go stand to the very last. That's what a friend can do. If I won't stop, since I won't stop when I talk. 
but I don't see your car. I don't, I don't, I don't even see them. I don't see them. All I want is either we get peace by peace or we get peace by pieces. Anyhow you want, you choose one. The last video I made, I said it. If you want to have peace, I can heavily help you. Just like I was doing to have peace. If you don't want to have peace, I am very vam Let me say clear what he said. I don't know joy and lemon was having something from Adam. Yeah, you can take me to any take me anywhere you want me to go and say it. I will start go talk. All I knew is that she's an actress and she came as a media assistant, as a, as a personal assistant to him, rather is to his page and the rest of them. I be when man won't do something with woman, he go call me for phone. Tell me. I mean, I mean, help them hold touch lights when they run. If I'm aware, you know me. Thank God he said it, that I don't take nonsense. I'm very strict and blunt to those that are around me. At the talk, I'm A as a B. The least I fear no, I'm A. I fear nobody. I'm fearless. I can only respect you. You're not God. I fear only my creator. Chim, chim. Only my chi. Now nah, I fear because he's the only one that can take my body and take my soul. You can only take the body. There is nothing you can do with my soul. I fear no human. I go talk him if I know him. I go bang him. Nothing will happen. I no shake. I stand. So if I tell you, sir, I don't know. I don't know. If I tell you, sir, I know. You would not beat me. Never. It would not happen. Ta. Back to the issue. Only you still rush. Go bring out divorce paper. She say you won't really go. If you don't want to go, you will not bring out divorce paper. After some time, you see that that one is not working and we, they, they keep postponing us, postponing the issue. Then you went ahead now to say, okay, you're sorry, you want to withdraw the divorce and the rest of them. You came back home crying after we came back from the village and saw that you were building. I mean, it's not me. Still come talk on your behalf. If not, if I still a split cushion, or maybe that guy could not fling you out. Not me. Still come talk on your behalf. He you say you have withdrawn the case, you know, and all of a sudden now you want the case to come up. You want us to go to court. You want to share properties. Your brothers are coming. Then you don't forget how your brothers say they come, they come fight. They were fighting. This other one, the big bottle. I'm at me, I'm at me. Yet, your brothers are not even coming to say, okay, what is the way for? What can we do to sort this? He said, no, they will just want to let everybody share this thing. Let's share this. Let everybody go their separate ways. And you're telling me you want that peace from one set. You won't be saying your brother come break, but your brother stone fan for David head. He had come up blood was bleeding that day. Huh? Your brother come to the house, boss bought to jam us for estate road. They, they threatened and said, Made a share about it now. And you're telling me you guys want peace? This is what you guys have is accumulated grievance. And I don't plan and down. You guys have sit in the other room to talk and have all this thing planned out. That like, yes, okay, he's rich, he has the money. Can we just take this thing and go? If not, you would not be after the divorce paper or sharing of any property. Or your brother said, no, you, go. The, you guys made it clear. The whole family came. Down to your brothers, your in-law, even down to your mom, the big mommy. Come, say, the, I was thinking she's even there to even, okay, let's sort things out. No, she's just there. That I'll, uh, give my daughter or let her Give my daughter or let her go. The same man will open shop for you. Why do you talk to her like this? Let's just say, okay, all of us are behaving childish. We are all childish. Both me, Lemon, Mary, everybody, Alex are all childish. You as an adult, what are you supposed to do? Mo live say, okay, Joy, don't get belab for I'm picking don't they? But what are you supposed to do as an adult? Are you not supposed to call these people in order? To order rather. What is this issue? What is it that we can't sort with? If this is it spiritual, let's pray. Is this physical? Let's do what we are doing. Instead, no, you are dead. To let them make sure they give your daughter oh, let your daughter go. And you're saying you really love your husband, you want to stay? The hundred is written on the wall. And besides, Lemon have already seen proof that yes, the baby belongs to him. If you know see proof, you know go take him. Oko no yibo ko oba anambra state. If you know see proof, if you know they sure, leave her and take the sure. Oba sarge, it's nobody's business. But if he's not sure, he would not take that baby. Just joy in the house. No leave your space so No leave your space open. People there where they die to dive inside. Vice versa. So please, next time when you want to say something, you sit down, address yourself with that very statement you want to make. Check out if it makes sense for your voice and mouth. Nevertheless, I'm still waiting to get handcuffed. I'm not carrying me go sell because I committed a